Well, we're back, ladies and gentlemen. Hello, ladies and gentlemen. This is Boris Sal from Ireland Training here. And today, we're going to be talking about NAKD. I hope you're all doing well. Oh my goodness, this feels very strange for me. It's been so long since I've recorded a video. This is probably going to be a pretty bad video because it's been over two months since I last done one. But yes, we, we are sort of back on the horse and I hope that I can keep bringing you all content and hopefully this is something that you will still enjoy. And, you know, thank you to everyone that stuck around with us through like a pretty difficult spell. Um, basically, I'm going to give you a quick update about what's been going on. So over the summer, I have been working at the cooperative, which is like a sort of, it's a small brand in the UK uh, for food shops. And, you know, I've been trying to accumulate some money throughout just to ensure that I was good for university for this upcoming year. Um but yeah, that's that's pretty much an overview of what I've been doing. Uh, I've also been, you know, going on holiday with my dad, etc. And yeah, there, there's been absolutely nothing bad that's happened. But I, but life has just gone the way, basically, right? So that is where I have been. But I hope you're all having a fantastic day and you're all doing very very well now let us get on to nakd it has been so so long and i need to get my head around it so for anyone who has new news about nakd be sure to hit me up because i'm a little bit behind with the times but i'm going to be doing a graphical analysis today of what i think is going on with an akd and it has been a while since i've actually looked at a stock graph right so this could be a bit rusty but as you can see we broke out and we saw highs of 94 cents, which for NAKD is absolutely amazing. Now, my current entry point for NAKD is about 56 cents. So right now I'm at a very healthy profit, even at the 76 cent mark. But as you can see, we are currently having a bit of a support structure around the 66 to 67 cent mark, which is lovely to see. We're seeing higher highs and lower lows, which is beautiful. Now, if we do a quick graphical analysis here, so as you can currently see with the support structure, that's probably the best support structure we can draw so far. And this is on a two hour chart. Um, you sort of see the sort of direction we'd be going. We have been in a bit of a bearish flag at the moment, but that's not too bad because as you can see, we are reaching the end of this bearish flag. Now, if I bring that down to sort of about here, because I feel like the other one's a little bit of an outlier because we shot back down again, you can sort of see where we're heading. Now, I predict, that what will do we so by the sixth before the sixth we should see some price action we should see a direction of where this stock is going to go and i believe that we actually may shoot out of this because as you can see as well with this lower support structure here we are genuinely trending upwards which is lovely to see and you can sort of see like this nice little crossover here with this bearish canal that we be or bearish flag we've been seeing. We are starting to see a nice support structure developing that's going upwards slightly. So that makes me think that we are going to fare well and we are going to branch out into this upper bracket here of the support structure because I think we're going to bounce off this level here. And I think that we are going to shoot above the bearish flag that we've been in. And we should see a nice little bit of an uptrend when the market opens, I believe. So I think the I, th I think we could potentially hit 80 cents and i think at the 80 cent mark if we can then create a new support level somewhere around that area then we could push up to that one dollar mark that lovely one dollar mark which we have all been waiting for now i know jdr has had a, like a fair bit of stuff going up on his twitter um sorry about a disruptive technologies company actually which is interesting so he's not going down the route that i thought he was going to go down of getting a supplier he's trying to get someone who's going to develop that e-commerce structure for his brand now it's a very interesting move and it's quite a brave one as well because there's so many technology companies out there and he is invested in one big one but he said it's going to be a disruptive one which means it is a technological giant at the moment and it is an industry leader so i'm excited to see what he brings to the table there um so let's have a quick look have we got any news here so yeah that was when nakd shot up now we'll have a quick look at like the VWAP. The VWAP currently, as you can sort of see, we are trending a little bit downwards on the VWAP, but we are sort of coming under this, this green candlestick we finished on, which is actually a good sign because that means that it's destined to go back up again because we have been going down a fair bit. Uh, looking at the exponential moving average, where are we? Exponential moving average. Um, you can sort of see here, we have been below the five day and we've been slightly above the two day moving average. So we're below the five, 
the the 120, the 10, the 60, and the 20 exponential moving average. So again, that's a good bullish sign because that means that we've been trading below of what we've been estimated to trade at over the last 20 days. So again, all the directions and all the sort of data that I have here suggests that we are going to shoot up above this bearish flag that we have been in, which is great to see. Now, looking at the MACD, we have been trending bearish on the MACD. But again, I can see a nice golden crossover here happening pretty soon as well. And I think that's going to happen at market open. And I wouldn't be surprised if we saw the market open at around between 75 to 80 cents, which would be fantastic, honestly. And I think it's very possible because especially with all the hype and all the media around NAKD, especially that JDR is now closing in on that deal, which we've all been waiting for for so, so long. I think it has put NAKD in such a prosperous position. And I genuinely think that we could see some really good price action in the upcoming days slash weeks. I think we, we have to trade above one dollar pretty soon right and i don't think jdr is going to wait much longer because we are closing in on that deal and i think as soon as that deal is announced the stock's going to blow up honestly because i think that this disruptive technologies company that he is currently targeting is going to put us levels above what we are currently trading at um you know the 300 million war chest is definitely going to help towards that and i think that he may even have a bit more now because that that 300 million that they announced was back in february so we have still been trading it and the retail investors have still been flooding into nekd but you know we haven't actually seen an increase in the war chest which doesn't make sense so i think he's actually got a lot more cash than what they're suggesting with the 300 million i think that 300 million is now probably around 500 million i have no data to back that up but it would make sense at the same time right we have seen a lot of upward ticks and we've seen a lot of upward trends and a lot of volume behind nekd so you know i think i'm quite confident in this stock still for anyone who has been blowing up my twitter because i see you all i just haven't been responding i have taken a complete social media break you know honestly uh, i've been focusing on my other social media site coalesce uh, my esports brand um but yeah i mean i've seen you all blowing up the twitter asking what's my opinions of nakd and this video is just to say my opinions have not changed i am still an nakd ape and i probably will be for the rest of my existence until this stock reaches 230 230 or bust as we all say right so you know that is a quick update video from me i hope you've all enjoyed this video if you haven't remember to hit that like button and subscribe for new we are back baby and i can't wait to bring you all some more content thank you for watching this b boy sam from Ar sam from armada training see you next video on the channel take care ladies and gentlemen